What's up my Koopa Troop, it's Koops, and welcome back to another episode of Paper Mario Color Splash. We're back at the Emerald Circus, where the Yoshis have escaped, the audience is mad, and the show must go on. So let's go ahead and sneak inside this back area and find out where Lemmy Koopa has gone to. Because uh, we need to find him, or something like that. We're hiring! Join the circus! Save the world! Shy guys, understudies, especially welcome. Yeah, shy guys are definitely welcome. They'll just end up disappearing and dying somewhere, but... Otherwise, pretty good. Hey, it's the, uh... It's Bowser's little ship thingy. What, what's the actual name of that? You guys will have to let me know in the comments. I don't know what, know what the name of that flying ship is. It's got a name, right? Hmm, what is this curtain do? Or this rod? You ain't pulling that. Oh, I just broke something. Or not. The music said I did something good. Hey, we can squeeze it. Is this a disco ball? Oh, this might... It looks like a Death Star. <laughs> this might be the thing we need. Yeah, that might be the thing we need to uh, get Lemmy dancing. This relic from the years past is making a comeback. None can resist this call to hit the dance floor. Dude, it's true. When that thing starts spinning, the lights go around in a circle. You gotta go move. You gotta go shake it. So, we gotta use that on Lemmy, followed by the ice pick. All right, I think we're actually prepared for this battle. We have stuff. The boss fights might be BS, but if you buy everything, they're less BS. <laughs> I think. That's, 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 not, that's my new plan of action from now on. And we're back! Thanks for your patience, folks! Please put your hands together for... The Mario and UEG! Oh, that was, that was a bad pun. Super Fun Time Show! Don't be shy, fellas! Oh, oh. He's got stage fright. Uh, no, 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 no. I don't do well in front of crowds. Well, here goes nothing. <laughs> Um, um, uh, you guys, uh, you, you guys like impressions? No, you suck. Oh, we're ready for it. Tin cans always be like. Wow, that was just about the worst thing I've ever seen. That was, that was actually terrible. Tough crowd. That joke used to kill it back at the recycling plant. I, I, I've, I feel like we should let Huey die several times in this game. I thought maybe because paper is recyclable too. That, that actually sucked. It's Mario's turn. Let's let Mario show you, Huey, how to entertain a crowd. Okay, Mario, got any jokes up your sleeve? Please tell me you've got something. All right, watch and learn. Oh. 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 Holy shit, Mario died. He's alive. How did he do that? Really? They like that? But my tin can impression flopped? Where was my mushroom at? You wouldn't understand what to do with a mushroom. That was my. I know how, I, I know how to use mushrooms. Okay, that was just classic, Mario. And now, the moment you've all been waiting for. The Emerald Circus main act. These potentially death-defying performances will keep you on the edge of your seat. Ooh, potentially death-defying. That means potentially death not defying, which means they're going to die. Oh. And with that, let's get this party started. It's time to fight, then. Is that the main performance? Please welcome to the stage. I see a speech bubble up there. A terrifying green beast with eight heads, 16 eyes, and one wheel. The trick riding, introverted, unicycle shy guys. How are they even pedaling? Your legs don't reach it. Oh, that's impressive. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, go. Dude, that is, I, I can't fight that. That's hell impressive. Unicycle Shy Guys. Okay, what can I use to defeat the Unicycle Shy Guys? Owl Block? Are they kind of considered like a stack? Can I hop slipper on there? Dumb, 
dumb butts. Let's let's try that. Let's let's just try hop slippering. I don't want to waste too many cards. Cause this looks like this might be a uh, a gambit. Okay, did, I, did they lose any? Yeah, they're falling out. What are the Yoshi's doing down there? Wait, Yoshi, hey buddy, what's up, man? How you doing? What's this? Who let that Yoshi out? Hey, what's up, man? Wait, why am I? What? He's gonna eat me? Oh, you poor Mario. That Yoshi ate your precious card, didn't he? That wasted a card? Oh, you son of a. I'm gonna take that Yoshi out. Do I have to block again? I don't know. Under study refill, they're a dime a dozen. I, they only lost four? Oh no. How about that? Unicycle battle cry, eh? Oh, yo, Yoshi. You son of, I really needed those hop slippers. Oh no, I, I have like no battle cards. This could actually be rough. All right, we gotta kill him. Wait, no. I also wanna add. Son of, man, that Yoshi screwed me. Hot damn. Line jumps are useless. D will this kill? You know what, let's, let's do this. And hopefully this will kill. That's a lot of cards. I didn't really buy enough cards here, did I? Oh wait, they're, they're dying left and right now. Wait, now I wasted so many cards. <laughs> oh. Well, that was easier. I thought the hop slipper would work. Just do the jump. Boo, boo, boo. Yay, encore. <laughs> All right, well, I wasted a ton of cards there. Oh, well. Well, those guys are fired. Speaking of fired, let's give an unseasonably warm welcome to our next guest, the fire-breathing dino beast and their miserable trainer. Ooh. Oh, I'm impressed. Dude, this guy's pretty cool. All right, so these guys are pretty sweet. Animal Trainer Shy Guy and Wild Dino Rhino. Wild, not not standard Dino Rhinos. These are the wild ones. Let's try a couple big line jumps. Those are pretty solid. Maybe these will uh, do the trick and knock these guys out. Let's just see what that does in terms of damage. I don't know if these guys will be replenished as well. Okay, the guy died. That's good. No, go away! We oh, gotta yeah, fight him now. Dude, the timing is way slower than I think. Oh, he wasted my card too. Go away, Yoshi, I hate you. Uh-oh, you done did it now, Mario! Without a trainer, wild dino rhino start rampaging! Hold on to your mustache. Holy. Holy sh. Oh, that's so delayed. Damn. Ooh, it's a backup trainer. Lucky you. Okay, so I can kill the guy, and that's fine. I have to kill the guy. But if I kill him, they do a huge combo attack. Yeah, I lose a lot of HP. All right, I got the I got the gist here. So I want to kill them all in one swoop. But that's kind of hard. I I like the big line jump to start off with. <laughs> I'm gonna actually have to use paint because I'm gonna be out. Let's hit him with a pal block two at the start. Yeah, whatever. That the order doesn't really matter here too much. And then uh, fire flower because I need. There we go, like that, perfect. That should hopefully kill everything. If not, it, they should be powed out, so. They can't do much now. This will refill my paint supply, which is now very low. Good, now I can attack next turn. That guy's dead. Will they die? Oh, they didn't die. 
Can they rampage even? No, but that can come back. Oh, it's a backup trainer. Lucky you. How many backup trainers do they have? <laughs> it's not really working there, is it? Poor, poor animal trainer shy guy. I think the... Man, this is going to use a lot of paint. I didn't realize these big ones use so much paint. I want to eat camera the first guy to death, and then I will paint those last guys to death. Man, those use so much paint. Yikes. Oh, I should save the e-cameras in case there's more stacks. Oh, gosh, that's, this was kind of bad of me. These guys are easy to kill anyways. Probably bad. Oh, well. These wild island ones seem pretty tanky, don't they? Let's see, if we, let's see if we can finish them off here. First guy gonna die? Dude, he's not dead yet? That's insane, how tanky are they? Got the time in that one though. A little early, just like a second early. Oh, wow, this is not easy actually. I, I've been trying, if you're too stingy with your cards, you end up losing all your cards anyways. It's kind of a rough, rough game some ways. We're gonna heal up here. Hurl hammers will probably kill. If it doesn't though, I'd be in real trouble. So let's go ahead and use a regular ice flower afterwards. In case it doesn't kill. There we go, that should, this should be good. Wanna heal up too, don't wanna die to anything random. Any BS around here? Okay, killed off the buddy. Didn't kill the second guy. All right, well, the good thing I used this. Did not expect these things to be so tanky. Oh, it took all four shots. Wow, they are insanely powerful. Bravo, bravo! I like how the Toads are all happy and all the Shy Guys are so mad. Let's keep this party rocking! It's a balancing act the likes of which the world has never seen! Say hello to the Iron Shelled Buzzy Beetle Tower of Terror! Oh! 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 That's so cool! I'm impressed! I'm, in I'm impressed! Color me impressed! Alright, how should we defeat the Buzzy Beetle Tower? Generally, buzzy beetles are insanely powerful, and you have to flip them over with pal blocks because you can't jump on their heads. Plus, I can't jump on top of them anyway. This guy's got a spike. Oh, freak, I see the Yoshi. I'm going to put on a... Uh... I'm going to put on defense. I don't know if I want to attack because that stupid Yoshi. If I fail, he just eats my stuff. All right, let's just do this in case I fail because I hate that Yoshi. Oh, he does it right at the start? Oh, it's so slow. Well, at least I have a defense. I don't know if it's going to help, though. Yeah, that didn't work at all. Man! I screwed that up. I hate the Yoshis, dude. <laughs> They're so... Why aren't they on my team? Why do the Yoshis want to kill Mario all of a sudden? Maybe when they show up, I should just, like, give up fighting. Huge iron jump could be useful, depending on... I'm just going to do this. Hopefully kill everyone with that combo right there. Okay, they did flip over. Nice, nice. And that guy's out. What? They lost their balance? That's not in the script. Oh, unfortunately, my big one's gonna go to waste in this tiny dude. Look out, bro. Oh! Absolutely crushed. That was pretty funny, though. Yeah, he flipped over. That's lame. I didn't, I didn't, I thought they'd all like kind of fall on. They wouldn't split apart. I thought they would just kind of fall over. Uh, uh, I'd rather use uh, one of these things or something. Can they even attack? Yeah, I'll use the Koopa Troopa. I think he can kill. And I'd rather use the Koopa Troopa because 
they're useless against boss bosses due to the fact they just run away. So they're better just using it against random enemies because they suck otherwise. Wait, they run against other enemies too? They're freaking useless. Stupid freaking Koopas, man. Oh gosh, I hate the... <laughs> the enemy cards are actually just a giant joke. I jump, it doesn't do anything. It flips them over once, right? So you have to like do it twice. You have to use two jumps on them to make them flip over. I don't really want to use another pal block, but I might be forced to. How about battle spin? Let's see if there's any good cards. I kind of want a double jump. Yeah, that'd be good. This is a double jump. So let's flip the face cards over. We want, uh, it's after the double hammer. So after double hammer, do it. Perfect. That's what we want to use right there. Throw it up there and we are ready to battle. Especially when there's only one enemy like this, I think it's smarter to use it like this. Oh no, go the hell away. Oh. Mario expertly guards himself against Yoshi's ravenous appetite. Get the hell out of here, Yoshi. Screw you, bro. He slipped over, and now I kick him away. Bye-bye. A victory! Encore! Encore! Ah, what? Why do they say boo and still throw coins? Ahem. And now for the final act. The high-flying acrobatic bad boys, the trampoline shy guys. Hey, this looks pretty cool. Oh yeah. Oh, it's a giant stack of shy guys on a trampoline. Ooh, how, 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 what? How do I fight this? <laughs> Can I hit him with a flower? I don't want to use a bunch of stuff because I'm not really sure what how to attack them. I will... I'm gonna use the broken one. I, I don't really know what to do here. Do these things still suck, the red sniffets? Like, do they do anything? Let's try this. This is a weird combination of cards, but I just don't know what they do, so... Yeah, screw you, bro! Oh, eh? The trampoline shy guys fell down! Uh, okay, I didn't do anything, though, to him. Oh, this trampoline's blocking everything. I gotta jump on them, huh? Okay, we figured that out. So I have to jump on them. How to jump on the trampoline, guys. I could use, but I don't have any other jumps besides my line jumps. Oh gosh, this actually might suck. I'll put on a spiky helmet so when they jump on me, they'll feel the pain. That sounds like a good idea. Let's do that first off. I'm running a little bit out of paint. I'll use a paint card too. Uh, I could fill in another thing then. I think I think when they're bouncing, I might not be able to hit them when they're like this. Let's try, let's try a blaze hammer. And I gotta jump on them. I have like no jumps. Let's try using the big line jump to at least do something to them. Okay, that's a weird another set of combo cards, but I might have to use some battle spin because I don't do, do not have any cards. I do, don't have any cards. There we go, our paint's back up. That didn't do any damage. Now they're down. Eh? The trampoline shy guys fell down! I think you have to knock them down first before you can jump on them. Oh, I only killed like two of them, didn't I? Yeah, then they get back up. I don't know if they'll dodge or not, but... Oh, you suck. You actually suck, shy guys. What the hell? Wait, this is really bad, because I need to hit them with the hammer and then jump on them, but I can't do both of those, because if I put hammers down, I can't use my battle spin technique, can I? Wait, I might just be actually screwed here. We gotta use an item card, but I don't know which one to use. Do I have any replicas? Because those don't work during boss fights. Let's use a light bulb, but I'm going to hit it with the hammer first, because I'm pretty sure they have to be knocked over before you can hit them with any damage. And I'm worried that for some reason this wouldn't work. Wait, if... 
I don't think I need to fill it in with paint. I'm pretty sure that you just have to knock him over. Let's try this. I actually might be screwed though, because I have to knock it over with a hammer first before I can hit him. And you can't do two action cards. Oh wait, no, yeah you can. Yeah, you actually never mind, you can't do that. What they just left. They just dodged? Come on, game, what the hell? How am I supposed to know that? The hammer didn't knock him over or something? What happened? Oh, the trampoline shy guys nimbly dodged the blow with a big jump. Man, this is just getting lamer by the second. All right, all right, game. I'll play your little crap. So let's throw, we gotta get a battle spin in here. I need a jump. The double jump is what I need, actually. If a hop, actually, hop slipper would be good too, because there's a lot of them. Let's see what we got here. I think the double jump's all I really have the option for, huh? Where does the double jump come? It comes after the mushroom. So right there, I got it. Nice. So now we've got the double jump. I want, remember, I want to hit them first with the hammer. I'll put that up there for now. And hit them once with a hammer just to knock them over. Does the hurt, wait, does the blaze hammer count as knocking it? You know what? I'm not sure it did. I'll knock it with a big KO hammer. I think that should work. Wait, I don't need to fill it in with paint. No, actually, maybe I do. Maybe that's why it failed the first time. Okay. Let's go with this. See if this works out. Nice. Now they're knocked over. Uh, the trampoline shy guys fell down. No! Dude, I hate the freaking timing on the jump sometimes. That's so obnoxious. Oh, I wasted so much. <sighs> so mad at myself there. Oh, I definitely blocked that in time. No. I'm actually so tilted after that. I even didn't, wasn't even paying attention because I had two jumps. Ah! Ah! Okay, let's do that battle spinner. I need the jumps. We want the double jumps again. Oh, they also have an ice pick replica, but that also wouldn't help us. Thanks, game. So it's after the fire flower right there. All right. Oh, that was... Oh, that was so close. I'm glad it counted. So we want the double jumps. I actually want to heal up too. Uh, that hammer did work. I need to paint it in though. Gotta get the order correct. Perfect. This should be good enough. As long as I don't screw it up this time, we should win. I hate jumping, like I said, up on top of enemies. It feels like it's really hard to get the timing right sometimes. All the time. All right, knocked over. Not really an excuse, though. These guys aren't that high up. Dude, seriously? I screwed that up? Oh, I'm actually just terrible. That's so lame because I got to do the entire thing again because I don't have any jumps. Actually, you know what? Screw it. Screw it. There's only one guy left anyways. I don't want to do the card spin. Screw the card spin. <laughs> this is such a waste, but... I got to knock him over before I can jump on him. Die, please. Ugh. What a breathtaking show. Put your hands together for all of our performers tonight. They all died, all right. Why are the Shy Guys? Oh, they're just booing. Yeah, I would boo too if I was the Shy Guys. I mean, they just watched tons of their brethren die to Mario. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Nice, got some hearts, got some health. And that's our show, folks. Many thanks to the stars of our show tonight. Huey! Thanks for joining us tonight. Don't forget to stop by the merch table on your way out. Merch table? I don't care about the stinging merch table. I want that big paint star. Where's that clown lemmy? Where is that clown lemmy? I know we should hit the save block though. I'ma hit the save block. I gotta find that clown lemmy, huh? Where could he be? Is he up here? That was cool. 
We on top the the rooftop now? Oh no, we just busted a hole. There it is. Ooh, it's the great big paint star. It was probably up here all along. Uh oh, there's a hole in the tent. This must be where the star came out of the tent. Some illusion. Does that mean Lemmy came out through this hole too? Is that Lemmy back there? Ha! Well done! It seems I've been caught! It's boss fight time. For some reason, my magic wand doesn't have any effect on the paint star. So the only way I could make it disappear was to employ a little <laughs> sleight of hand. But no matter, the point of this circus wasn't to show off my magical prowess. The point was to steal the paint star and embarrass you in front of a giant crowd at the same time. Seems kind of weird, now that you think about it. And now it's time for the grand finale. <laughs> it is time for the grand finale. Let's go, Lemmy. You and me, bro. This is it! The moment you've all been waiting for! The final performance of Mario's career! Oh, he just summoned a bunch of dudes! Go, Mario! It's your birthday. Juggler bro and circus bro. These guys worked too hard last time we faced them. And I'm hoping they'll be about the same this time. So I just want to murder them as quickly as possible. Using some uh, high damaging items. Can I attack Lemmy back there too? I don't really know. Hit him with the hurl hammers. There's some good stuff. And then let's hit him with this. All right, that's a lot of damaging cards. Well, let's see if we kill him. Now you see it, now you don't. Ooh, blocked it. Ooh, nicely done, applause. Maybe if I hadn't blocked that, I wouldn't be able to see this stuff. Oh, that'd be bad. If that's what he actually does. Not being able to see it? I don't think that affected his ball, did it? Oh, that affected him, though. I can't hit him on top, then. Uh, I've only done a tiny bit of damage to him, though. Can I hit him with a hammer? No, it looks like I have to jump on him. Hmm, that's a weird attack. Oh, more crap, though. So he summons crap every single time that I gotta deal with. Patui and Juggler Bro makes it hard to hit to get to him. And I have to jump or throw things at him is what it looks like. I'm gonna get this so I have some more paint to work with next time. Uh, I could use... Will Balloon's Replica do anything? I can use Replica cards because I have to use them in the attack somewhere. I gotta kill that first guy. And then I can do jumps on the other ones, I believe. So let's do this. I'm not sure if Replica will work on him or not. And then we can do line jump? No, let's do more hurl hammers. Like, I don't really have a good good way of reaching him. So this is something. I know in boss fights you want to wait till the boss says something before you do any of your thing cards. So I don't want to use those just yet. Nice, killed that thing off. So let's see what the balloon replica does. Now you see it, now you don't. That's not too hard to block. Oh, see, he, he ditches. He dodges for the replica thing. This will kill off the last guy. Not not that important, but... Or will it? What does this do again? Will it damage the enemy? <laughs> Bye, bro. <laughs> nice seeing you. <laughs> Take it easy. Thing cards? What is this, baby's first battle? Applause! Yeah, think cards don't work on you, we know. I really could use some jump cards though. Maybe I'll battle spin for some of those. These don't do much damage, hurl hammering stuff to him, so. All right, what you gonna summon this time, bro? More of the same, more of the same. Circus Bro and Patui. So, I need, let's say, two cards to kill off these guys in the front. That will work, and probably... 
That sh this should be enough to kill off the guys in the front, I think, right? Big hammer. That should kill. I think that should be good enough. If they don't die, they won't do too much damage to me either. Let's, uh... Oh, sorry. I gotta do it this way. This is so annoying. You have to do battle spin first. You can still add cards to it, but you gotta do it first. It's really annoying. Actually, I didn't see all what there was. I don't want replica cards. Replica cards are useless. We want jumping cards. So I want the iron boot, the double iron boots, which is after the double hammer. So double hammer and then iron boots. Okay. That's what we'll be using on Lemmy. It is really annoying how you have to use these last. Like that doesn't really make a whole lot of sense. Why can't you just spin whenever? All right, there we go. It's all filled up. So the idea, and I want, I'd like to jump on him again. Do I have anything else to jump on him with? Even though a big line jump could be useful. So let's try this out just to get as much damage as we can on this guy. And hopefully these cards kill off these things in the front. Now you see it, now you don't. I want to keep blocking that, whatever it is. I don't know. I'm supposing it probably stops me from seeing things. Oh, that worked way better than I thought. This, this will be good. The hurl hammers are brought to kill off the next thing if I needed it, but this will work perfectly. I can get all this damage extra on top of him. Now we can do our iron jumps. Perfect. And this will just be one or two jumps. But it's a big jump, so that's hel always helpful. This show is in full swing. It's almost time for the grand finale. What's he doing now? What's that? A spiked ball? Oh, this is definitely bad. Yes! My magic wand can transform into a magic ball. A wonder ball. Yes, yes, clap for the wonder ball. Is this the time we have to distract him? I think it is. I think it's time to distract him, because if you look at it, I can't touch that thing. I can't jump on him. I can't hammer it. I can't get close to it. It's distraction card time. Pretty sure it's Disco Ball. Followed by Ice Pick. Yes, that should distract. That should break the ball. Then I can attack him with other stuff. And then I want to use some of these new things. I want to use this Claw Hammer. And we've never seen the recorder. Let's uh, let's do it this way. Let's see what we got here, team. I'm excited. Hopefully this works. Otherwise, I'm out of the card. That, that would suck. Wait, he's gone? Oh, no. I screwed it up. Oh, no. I was so, I was so sure of myself. Oh, wait. I didn't. He came back. I'm just tapping it with the beat. Lemmy's dancing. All right, now he's distracted. <gasps> a disco set with a disco ball. This groove, it's too much to bear. I've got to boogie. I feel you, Lemmy. I feel you, man. Don't we all have to boogie sometimes in our life? Now we can try ice picking his stupid balloon. Get stabbed. Oh! Oh! No! You popped my Wonder Ball! Do you even know what that thing retails for? I have no idea. But now you're off the, the Disco Ball, and now I can actually kill you. <laughs> oh! That got the excellent on the timing. That was a little more obvious, though, when you should do it. Wow, that just mashed his face in. Let's see what the recorder does. There's Zelda music in here? I don't know if this would distract him too, but. Oh, that did a lot of damage too to him, actually. Oh, now you're weak, Lemmy. Now you're actually weak. Weaker than most of the stuff I fight. Well, I'm gonna hit you with the megaphone. 
don't know what kind of damage that does, but I want to use it on you. Uh, and in case that doesn't kill you. No. Hit you with the big hammer. Hit him with the KO hammer in case that doesn't kill. Should be good though. Let's let's hope this mega phone just murders him. Screams into his ear. Ow, that looks painful. Oh, that that didn't that sucked actually <laughs> in terms of damage. But maybe this will finish him off. Oh, out of here! Damn, we cleaned Lenny out. <laughs> he really fired up tonight, Mara. You must have really enjoyed the show. I admit defeat, a spectacular defeat. There's more drama in defeat anyway. Victory is so overdone. And well, that was definitely the best circus I've ever been to. Now let's wake the big paint star. It's the last one. How do I wake it? Do I? Nothing's back here. Uh, how do I? Hello? Hello? Got it! You just fall down and hope land on top of someone down there. <laughs> maybe a trampoline or maybe a shy guy we just jumped on his head. Murdered. Maybe he's just squished now. Well, that feels kind of bad, doesn't it? Hey, we got the big green paint star, though! That's what I'm talking about, team! And 100% clear the Emerald Circus colorless spots. Oh, that's gonna open up. Wait, where are we going? Going off the map. We going A wall. We actually are going A wall. Where the hell are we going? <laughs> Come back, Mario and Huey. Oh, we're going over here. Why didn't we just fly over towards here in the first place? Why did we go off the map? We could have just gone on the map, you know? I couldn't quite tell which colors location the green big paint star just restored right now. But now all the big paint stars are back at Prism Fountain. Mario, Huey, you've both done splendidly. Mostly Mario. I'm the green big paint star. My account of these unfortunate events should make everything clear. You're probably still wondering why the fountain's paint turned black. No, I'm not actually. The truth is... What's the truth? Give me the truth. <laughs> Why is that guy's head all red and orange? Oh, there's dancing around the paint. That's yeah, that's what people do. Just drown themselves in paint. Hey! Oh, that friction though. I don't think paint's that much of a lubricant. They can just slide across it like that. Everyone's enjoying themselves. Bowser's like, oh man, I want to play. Yeah, I got a good idea. What? Huh? Oh! I guess Bowser wanted the uh, entire thing for himself. Oh, he mixed all the colors together, which makes black. Yeah, that actually makes sense. Wait, I think Bowser was just playing. Oh my gosh. He's a moron. He's actually a moron. He just wanted to play with the toads. And then when he mixed all the paint together, it turned to, it made it into black paint. And then he was covered in black paint and now he's evil. He's, he's just actually stupid. Just certified stupid. So that's what happened. It all makes sense now. You mix all six of the fountain's paint colors, the paint turns black. Bowser was just having fun mixing all the paint together. He didn't even have an evil plan after all. He's just stupid. You're telling me we could have just avoided this entire game if we just installed a don't mix the paint sign? Good idea, Huey. <laughs> Screw the game. Oh well, hindsight is 2020, and I've really enjoyed getting to know you, Mario. I wish I could say the same, Huey. I wish. But our quest isn't over yet. We still have to do something about Bowser. That's right! Now that all the big paint stars are back, it's finally time to fight Bowser! Okay, let's celebrate the return of all the big paint stars! Get wild! We now have all six big paint stars, though. And we've got the paint the dance floor music. 
with naked toads. All discotecas should have naked toads. Oh, the groove is real. That's going to bring us to 200 health. With Mario doing the disco pose. Nice. Mario, Huey! We've got all the big paint stars back. The only thing left to do is rescue the princess. I know, Toad. Right, but how do we find her? I was just assuming that the big paint stars would show us the way somehow. I didn't have a plan. Oh, ye of little faith. Mario, Huey, as promised, we will show you the way. Behold, the power of paint. The power of plot device. <laughs> Deus Ex Machina. <laughs> so when they, when your powers combine. Oh, it's filled in again. I'm not working on that. I'm not working on that. It made a rainbow bridge. Where's this rainbow bridge going to lead us to? Oh. Into the clouds. Actually, or is there an island down there? Stay, stay back. Stay back. Oh, a floating evil fortress. Oh, yeah. That Rainbow Road just ruined our entire map, though. Wait, is it actually called Rainbow Road? Probably, huh? Whoa, did you see that, Mario? It's like some kind of rainbow, but like also a road. A road made out of rainbows! That's ludicrous! Hey. Well, there's nothing to do but give it a try, I suppose. If this is what the paint stars gave us, it must be right. Let's go! Oh! Thank you! With all of your help, with all of the Koopa Troop help, we have found all six big paint stars, and we've unlocked the path, the rainbow road, to Bowser's castle. Bowser's... I don't, know, I don't know what it's called. I'm calling it Bowser's Castle for now. That means we're done with all that stuff. However, we got to head back out and check and make sure there's nothing else left to do, nothing else to cover. I think we're pretty close to done with this game, though, so I'm excited about that. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Paper Mario Color Splash. I hope you all enjoyed. Go ahead and karate chop that like button. Until next time. GG! GG!